Lagos State Governor Babajide Olushola Songwolu has expressed his administration's commitment to foster partnerships with key stakeholders to drive initiatives that will uplift the state's agricultural sector, reduce waste, and ensure that every Lagosian has access to nutritious food. The governor made this remark at the 11th Annual Summit of the Association of Lagos State Retired Heads of Service and Permanent Secretaries, Allahops, with the theme Agenda for Sustainable Development and Food Security, held at Radio Lagos, but to Popo's Hall, Agidingbi, Keja. Sonwolu, who was represented by the Deputy Governor, Dr. Kadri Obafemi Hamzat, stated that by integrating sustainable practices into every aspect of the state's development agenda, the government would achieve a Lagos that is resilient, self-sufficient, and a model for others to follow. While highlighting the initiatives put in place by his administration, Songwolu noted that Lagos State has made significant strides in agriculture and food production through initiatives such as the Agricultural Value Chain Development Program, Lagos Agripreneurship Program, and many others, but there is still much to be done. Speaking on the aptness of the summit, the governor noted that the summit will undoubtedly light the path of sustainable solutions. So food security is very critical and it's important for us to understand that it must be done in such a way that it is sustainable so that food is available, accessible, affordable for all of us. Labor State, we are trying to make a lot of strides in agriculture and food production through various initiatives, some of which we are listening to here. But so, I think it was the this speaker that said changing the name of the ministry is not enough. I agree. But why did you change it? There was a presentation that was done by somebody in Nigeria, in Abuja, Governor's Forum, NEC, and all the rest. And it shows that in some part of our country, stunting, there are doctors here, I've seen my lawyer, there are doctors. They said between the zero and five, in that region, 39% of the kids are stunted. And the doctors have told us, if you are stunted between zero and five, that child is dead. It's dead. Meaning that it's just a, a working corpse. So if you have 39%, and in Southwest, at the time it was 11%. So the question is, what do we need to do? Well, we talk about the Olympics, we talk about if a child is hungry, which Olympics? So it starts from nutrition. So, and that's why, if you look at our five year old man, that's what is meant to happen. And that's why it's just five years. To say, how do we make sure that our children are not starting? 